The phrase, "...think globally, act locally", or "...think global, act local", has been used in various contexts, including planning, environment, education, mathematics, and business. Definition Think globally, act locally", urges people to consider the health of the entire planet and to take action in their own communities and cities. Long before governments began enforcing environmental laws, individuals were coming together to protect habitats and the organisms that live within them. These efforts are referred to as grassroots efforts. They occur on a local level and are primarily run by volunteers and helpers. Think globally, act locally originally began at the grassroots level, however, it is now a global concept with high importance. It is not just volunteers who take the environment into consideration. It is corporations, government officials, education system, and local communities. Warren Heap states, "...it's really important to recognize that markets are different around the world, and company compensation programs should reflect a balance between global corporate philosophy and local practice and culture." Topic: <inaudible> Origin in town planning. The original phrase, "Think global, act local," has been attributed to Scott's town planner and social activist Patrick Geddes. Although the exact phrase does not appear in Geddes' 1915 book, Cities in Evolution, the idea as applied to city planning is clearly evident. Local character is thus no mere accidental old world quaintness, as its mimics think and say. It is attained only in course of adequate grasp and treatment of the whole environment, and in active sympathy with the essential and characteristic life of the place concerned. Patrick Geddes, was a Scottish biologist, sociologist, philanthropist and pioneering town planner. He was also responsible for introducing the concept of «region» to architecture and planning. He has made significant contributions to the consideration of the environment. Geddes believed in working with the environment, versus working against it. Town planning is important to understanding of the idea, «think globally, act locally». Urban management and development highly impacts the surrounding environment. The ways in which this is initiated is vital to the health of the environment. Corporations need to be aware of global communities when expanding their companies to new locations. Not only do corporations need to be aware of global differences, but also urban and rural areas who plan on expanding or changing the dynamics of their community. As stated, Addressing the complex urban environmental problems, in order to improve urban livability through Urban Environmental Strategies UES, involves taking stock of the existing urban environmental problems, their comparative analysis and prioritization, setting out objectives and targets, and identification of various measures to meet these objectives. Origins of the phrase The first use of the phrase in an environmental context is disputed. Some say it was coined by David Brower, founder of Friends of the Earth, as a slogan for Faux when it was founded in 1969, although others attribute it to René Dubose in 1977. Canadian «futurist» Frank Feather also chaired a conference called «Thinking Globally, Acting Locally» in 1979 and has claimed the paternity of the expression. Other possible originators include French theologian Jacques Ellul. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Education The term was increasingly applied to initiatives in international education and was advanced by Stuart Grauer in his 1989 University of San Diego publication, Think Globally, Act Locally, a Delphi study of educational leadership through the development of international resources in the local community. In this publication it was attributed to Harlan Cleveland. 
It is said that this term was used by German-American sociologist Eugen Rosenstock Hewasi in the 1950s or earlier, prior to the formation of the United Nations Organization. It is not only corporations that are acknowledging the importance of environmental issues, but also the education system. Government officials and school boards across the world are beginning to develop a new way of teaching. Globalization is now thought of as an important concept to understanding the world. Certain schools believe it is important to discuss global issues as young as five years old. It is students who are our future, therefore understanding the concept of think globally, act locally, is fundamental to our future. Business The term is also used in business strategy, where multinational corporations are encouraged to build local roots. This is sometimes expressed by converging the words, global and local into the single word, global, a term used by several companies notably Sony Corporation and other major Japanese multinationals in their advertising and branding strategies in the 1980s and 1990s. Currently more and more corporations are finding it extremely important to analyze the environmental damage of their company. The pressure they receive from government officials and local communities regarding environmental issues is vital to their company's image. Globalization is an emerging concept throughout the business world. It was first developed by the Japanese, however, it has now emerged throughout Western society. Globalization refers to the practice of conducting business according to both local and global considerations. Mathematics The phrase is an in-joke among mathematicians, as it is often used in situations where the global structure of an object e.g., a manifold, a Diophantine equation, or a group can be inferred from the local structure. See Hasse principle for a detailed description of one such example. See also Agenda 21 United Nations Global Goals equals 2015 to 2030 Sustainable Development Goals and its hashtag world's largest lesson, tell everyone, let's leave no one behind Global citizenship Green politics Netherlands fallacy